Hi everyone and welcome to Triple M Adventures with Bill. If you've been watching my channel, you'll see that I've been doing receiver range testing. And I did both the TBS Crossfire and the TBS Tracer Nano receivers. So what I wanted to do, because I purchased the antennas, the different antennas for both of these systems, I wanted to run the test again. I'm not going to put it in my test figures because the test figures are what the standard system supplied, how, how I, the results that I got but I wanted to redo it just out of curiosity to see what happened. And here is the TBS Crossfire Diamond Antenna. So now let's take a look at the tests and the data. Now I'm gonna run the penetration test again using the TBS Diamond Antenna on my Crossfire. So let's go. We are now listening out for telemetry warnings. telemetry lost okay we've lost telemetry at 147.2 meters that's 147.2 meters there are no rqly low or critical warnings so i just got a complete fail safe so i'm going to turn around Late quality critical. telemetry recovered telemetry lost telemetry recovered telemetry lost okay that's interesting so Yep, that's definitely telemetry recovered. Telemetry lost. Yep, that's definitely the telemetry was lost at 147.3. I think I'm going to be walking quite a distance. Okay, can I see the green LED? Yes, I can. Fell safe at 312.6 meters. That's 312.6 meters. I noticed on the way back that the LED on the receiver was flashing, going, the green one was coming on and then it was going off and the red one was coming on. And the only way I could get it to link back up again was to unplug the battery and plug the battery back in. So I'm not sure what was happening then. And it should have been well within range of connecting to the transmitter. But I just wanted to uh, report that. Now, if we take a look at the data for the Crossfire standard antenna, you can see the first telemetry loss was at 130.4 meters, and then it fell safe at 308.4 meters, and then continuously fell safe at 328.3 meters. But with the TBS Diamond antenna, it lost telemetry, uh, what's that, approximately 17 meters later at 147.2 meters. Um, it fell safe a little bit later as well. That's approximately four, four meters at uh, 312.6 meters, but it continuously fell safe after that. So it actually went a little bit further with the standard antenna, but it did fail safe a lot um, earlier. Now, if we take a look at the range test, what I did is exactly the same as I did with the tracer receiver I went to the 585 meter mark just to test because last time I couldn't get any telemetry with the crossfire system at this point and if you take a look at the uh, data you can see exactly the same problem it's at the 585 meter mark the there was no telemetry coming there was there were a couple of bits of data came through but it wasn't worth doing the uh, giving the figures because they were just the average was about 4.7 percent so that was interesting that for some reason the crossfire system does not like that particular test i do where i've got the building and the trees between it and the receiver well you can draw your own conclusions from the uh, information that i've given you 
Thanks for watching this video and if you enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up and if you really enjoyed it please subscribe to my channel and if you have any comments or questions please leave them in the comments section below because I'd love to hear from you and please share this video with your friends and please consider becoming a patron of my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching, happy flying, bye for now, bye.